Medical Board of Ohio has revoked the license of Dr. Wade Banker, a radiologist who owns Lux Laser Center in Maumee. The board cited cases involving 15 patients in its decision, some of those for cosmetic surgeries. One of those cases involved a tummy tuck patient needing mouth to mouth resuscitation. Lead investigator Brian Duggar spoke with a malpractice attorney today to ask how to choose the right doctor when you decide on a procedure. Brian? Yeah, what I can tell you is that Lux Laser Center is still open and two other providers are offering services at the facility. Now, Dr. Banker plans to appeal the decision and his license will not be revoked until late next week, but he is not seeing new patients. One of the options available to the board was to suspend him and send him to a charting class. Many of his issues involved failing to document care and follow up. Now, malpractice attorney Greg Peppel, who is not involved in this case, says it's important for consumers to research specialists before a procedure. If you're having you know, a more extensive procedure by any means, at least talk to your, your, your general practitioner if you have one. Who do you recommend? You know, do you know anything about this one particular doctor? And, you know, if you have a good relationship with your GP, that person would probably, I would think, at least help to lead you in the right direction. Now, Lux Laser provided me with the following statement late this afternoon. Dr. Banker has vigorously disputed the board's allegations at all times and will pursue any and all avenues of appeal to ensure the board's decision is in accordance with the law. While this appeal is pending, Lux Laser Center remains open and our licensed providers remain available to continue to provide outstanding care to our patients. Brian, you mentioned uh, researching doctors. What kind of tips do you have on how people can start that process? Yeah, one of the easiest ways is to simply go to the Ohio Medical Board's website to see if there are any complaints lodged against doctors. You can also see what kind of medicine they're licensed in. But it's also a good idea to simply ask for references, somebody you can call to find out about their experience with that doctor. Reporting in studio, this is Brian Duggar for WTUL 11. All right, Brian, thanks so much. And we'll continue to follow this story. Right now you can see all of the documents and our full story online citing each of these cases right there on the WTOL 11 News app.